Hello everyone! Welcome to my channel! This is Mom Saibel Explains. This video is all about solving problems involving rate. We have the first problem here. 10 is what percent of 200? It is important to identify first our given. We have 10, what percent, and 200. Our 10 here is the percentage. We're looking for the rate and 200 is our base. We are still going to use the same formula, which is percentage over base is equal to rate over 100. 100 is a constant number. Let's just substitute 10 over 200 is equal to n over 100. How to find n? Just do cross multiplication n is equal to 10 times 100 divided by 200. 10 times 100 is 1000 divided by 200. We can cancel the four zeros there. What's left is 10 divided by 2 is equal to 5. Then we can say 10 is 5% of 200. We have the next question. Miss May Ann has 20 boys and 30 girls in her physics class. What percent of the students are girls? We will first identify our percentage based on rate. For the percentage, we're looking for the number of girls that are part of the class, and that is 30. Our base is 50 because we have to get the sum of 20 boys and 30 girls, and we're looking for the rate. We'll use the formula percentage over base is equal to rate over 100. Let's just substitute. How to find for n? Just do cross multiplication. 30 times 100 divided by 50. Then we can just multiply 3000 then divided by 50 just cancel two zeros there. We'll have 300 divided by 5 will give us 60. It means 60% of the students are girls. Next question we have, Charlene was able to sell 30 apples out from 150 apples she displayed this morning. What percent of the apples were sold? Let's identify first our percentage based on rate. For the percentage, that's the number of apples being sold and that is 30. And our base is 50 and we're looking for the rate. So we'll still use the same formula. Percentage over base is equal to rate over 100. Let's just substitute. How to look for n? Just do cross multiplication. That's 30 times 100 divided by 150. 30 times 100 is 3000 divided by 150. Just cancel two zeros that's 300 divided by 15 will have 20 it means 20 percent of the apples were sold we have the last problem here 24 students in a class took the quiz if 18 students passed what percent of the class did not pass Let's identify first our given, the percentage based on rate. Our rate is what we're looking for. And then our base is 24 because it's the total number of students that we have. And for the percentage, we have to know the number of students who did not pass. So that's 24 minus 18 is equal to 6. So the, our percentage is 6. We'll use the same formula. P over B equals R over 100. Let's substitute. How to get the value of n? Just do cross multiplication. That's 6 times 100 divided by 24. 6 times 100 is 600 divided by 24. We will just use um, lowest term, 600 over 24. What number can we divide? Both numbers, that's 6. That's 100 over 4. That will give us 25. Therefore, 25% of the class did not pass the quiz. And we're done! Now 
Now it is your turn to solve. Please write your answer in the comment section. The question is, 250 is what percent of 50? I'll be waiting for your answer. Thank you. Don't forget to hit the like button if you think this is helpful. Till next time!